We are anonymous. We are legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. <laughs> Anonymous press release. Operation Africa is an ongoing effort by several activists within Anonymous who have begun collaborating. The focus of the operation is a disassembly of corporations and governments that enable and perpetuate corruption on the African continent. This consists of organizations responsible for child abuse labor, as well as internet censorship within the continent and globally. We are fighting alongside other operations such as OP Nigeria and Anonymous SA to help free the continent from the plague of exploitation that has been occurring for centuries. Child abuse and labor within African nations is rampant. 30% of African children between 10 and 14 are agricultural workers. Estimated 400,000 child workers in Rwanda, 120,000 worst forms of child labor. 40% of child prostitutes in Rwanda had lost both of their parents. 94% lived in extreme poverty and 41% had never been to school. 4,600 children are estimated to be working in small-scale mining in Tanzania. 1.9 million children aged 517 in Kenya are working. 3.2% of those have gone to secondary school. 5 million children estimated to work in Zimbabwe. In West Africa, 35,000 children are involved in sexual exploitation. The governing bodies of Africa have allowed these atrocities. Go on making children. Go without proper education or health care. Leaving their country in a position for further economic stunting. And a lower quality of life for their people. As long as this corruption occurs. The rich get richer while the poor get poorer. OP Nigeria has done a wonderful job tackling the corruption within their country. And now we shall begin collaborating from around the world for the betterment of the African continent. Operation Green Rights, run by Anonymous SA, has been tackling many corporations that push GMOs, wholesale processed foods and exploit Africa as well as her people and resources. They are fighting corporate giants such as Japont, Monsanto. South Africa Panad Seed and Pioneer. These companies are all guilty of distributing GMOs throughout out the continent. Without considering the ecological impact. And they must be stopped from further damaging the delicate balance of African biodiversity. Corruption has been established on the African continent. By native and foreign government corporate entities and has continued for decades. Often these tribulations were perpetuated by those who were supposedly there to help. The United Nations being one of them. They have been involved in countless cases of rape, child abuse and murder in Bosnia, Haiti, the Central African Republic, the Ivory Coast, Somalia as well as many other African nations. In Central African Republic, children who were starving and seeking food were forced to perform sexual favors for UN workers. We have always fought for the rights of the oppressed. And Africa and the strong people who live there are no exception. No longer will we stand by and watch these blatant abuses of power occur. We will continue to fight for their liberties. Until all of our brothers on the continent are freed from the shackles of corruption and greed. We will not sleep. We will stop at nothing. We are anonymous. They should have expected us. <laughs>